Hello everyone, in my previous video I already told you how you can purchase a domain and how you can purchase a hosting. In this video I am going to tell you how you can install WordPress and install a theme on your website. Uh, like for this you need to go to your hosting account and click on login to see panel. Now you need to see here is option provided by B Digital Host Server. It's called WordPress Toolkit. Just click on it. And now click on install WordPress. It will load list to a website added in your hosting account. I have one so here is showing. In my I am just going to give a title, it's WDS payment. Now I'm just going to install it. Here is your username or password email section. You can use your I am just going to system generate it. Now you can see here the installation is started. We need to wait around one to two minutes for this installation. If you need a hosting, you can just go to digitalhostserver.com. They are providing a best hosting in cheap and affordable prices. Here you can see they have started download and unpacking it. Uh, we need to wait until this process comes they are downloading the things to here uh, it is takes time sometimes because you know that they are downloading wordpress uh, theme wordpress software installation from another site or uh, now installing and unpacking it here so until they are download we just wait here uh, meantime you can also go with purchase hosting from the digital host server they have the best hosting and affordable prices like you can get a uh, one year hosting around in uh, five to six dollar uh, they are best hosting provider right now i am using their hosting uh, we need to wait i think around two minutes so what i am going to do now i am just going to uh, wait uh, but i think it's going to install it just Anomaly because you can only see that is 50% completed. They are configuring configuring the installation and securing the site for us. When it's completed, you just need to load once, uh, reload it because sometimes what happened now uh, the process is complete but they did not uh, they are unable to see the full page because of some software issues. Uh, maybe it's a software issue you can say you can say it is a uh, like a glitch something uh, maybe see panel will work it on it and fix it as soon as possible they will get give a reload button is also here but uh, until you can also re reload it through your browser so now what i'm going to do is trying to load this page again for just checking the WordPress installation Now you can see the list of WordPress installations. Ah, here it is my list. Now I'm going to log in it. Click on login button. Now it will redirect you to your admin panel of your site. Now it will reload until uh, you can see I don't have any SSL, just go in advanced section, proceed to. Uh, wdspm.click and save and just click on continue now you can see the dashboard of wordpress uh, actually this video is take longer so in next video i will tell you how you can customize